Hi there, in this short video we will see another application of quadratic functions and in this case we will apply this type of function on production possibilities frontier. We know about production possibilities frontier. It is basically the set of possibilities of production that can be there given various combinations of labor and capital. So if we consider that we have a quadratic function which is showing the relationship between the two goods that is good x and good y and if this is the quadratic equation we can solve it from two points of view that is we can solve it for its intercepts. One would be x intercept and the other would be y intercept. But in this case you can see I have written this additional s here it means that there can be more than one x intercepts. Why? Because the degree of the equation is 2 when it comes to x. So it means that I can expect two roots. For x intercept definitely the value of y will be equal to 0. This is why I have written 0 instead of y. Then we have the quadratic formula uh, which is very usual formula that we have understood many times and used. And x is equal to 12 and minus 14 if I solve this quadratic equation. So you can pause the video and you can use this formula to solve and you will find out the two roots of x that is 12 and minus 14. I can write this in the form of solution set with the ordered pairs in it. You can see that if uh, the value of x is 12 the value of y will be 0 it means it is an x intercept and when the value of my of uh, x is minus 14 the value of y will be 0 so it means that these are two y uh, x intercepts where the value of y is 0 now for the y intercepts what we can do is we can put x is equal to 0 and you can see now i have substituted x is equal to 0 which will give me the value of y which will be the x intercept it means that the value of x is 0 at this point. It is only 1 because the value of the power of y was 1. So only one root is there. The value of x is 0 when the value of y is 42. So now I have the three intercepts. These are the two x intercepts and this is the y intercept. Combining these I can get the production possibilities frontier and this is the diagram. This is the uh, x intercept in the negative dimension this is in the positive dimension and this is y intercept but if I use only these three points I will straight uh, have a straight line joining these two points and here again a straight line but we know that production possibilities frontier has a uh, shape which is bent outwards like this or it is concave to the origin so we will not just use these three values we will consider this function and we will try to find out further values of x and y by putting for example a different values of x here uh, we can do this for instance for this point i will put four here when i put four here and there the value of y will be 36 as i can see here this means that I can find this couple of values and this ordered pair as well and then I will be in a position to combine them and come up with this production possibilities frontier which is making sense on this side of y-axis but not on this because output or inputs cannot be negative. So this portion is actually uh, of relevance for us and this is how we can develop a production possibilities frontier if we have the function which is likely to be a concave function and a quadratic uh, equation will be there. So this is how another econ uh, economic application of the quadratic functions is understood here. Thank you.